from Divine Sistar of the Light Aurora Ray. Transmission from the Galactic Federation. Greetings, friends. I've received a new communication from the Galactic Federation to deliver to you. I am delighted to share the following message with you. Greetings. We are the Galactic Federation of Free Worlds. We greet you in love and light. Many of you are experiencing tremendous upheavals in your physical, emotional, and mental bodies at this time. It is part of a process that many call ascension, where you shift from the third dimension to the fifth dimension. The Galactic Federation, comprised of many benevolent extraterrestrial civilizations, is a federation of sentient beings from all over the universe, who have come together to help humanity and Mother Earth on our journey into the light. This message is part of telepathic communication from the Galactic Federation. It is being delivered through a number of people around the world who are communicating with us on behalf of their groups and followers. We are pleased that so many people have responded to our message. Our mission is to inform humanity about the changes taking place on your planet and encourage everyone to step into their own power in order to become true masters of the physical world and ultimately spiritual masters as well. We understand that this transformation will take some time for most people. We want to offer you guidance about what's happening right now so you don't have to figure it out alone. We are all part of the same infinite creator. There is no separation between us. In fact, there never was. We are all one. We are here to share our wisdom and help guide you through the coming days so that you can enjoy your journey on planet Gaia. We are here to help you heal and to help you remember who you really are so that you can move forward with your life in a positive way. This process is about your evolution into light beings, and we want to help you find your place in the great light family of the cosmos. You are all magnificent beings, full of great love and compassion, courage and passion. You have come into this existence to experience life and all that you can be. We wish to help you achieve your highest potential as you move into the new age of enlightenment, which is now upon you. The first step to having a clear mind is letting go of all the negative thoughts, behaviors, and emotions that don't serve you. It is not easy. It's even painful at first. But you have to do it if you want to make any progress. You have been through an intense purging process and you have experienced multiple fears, anxieties, doubts, and feelings of being overwhelmed. Now you are experiencing many physical symptoms similar to when you were going through puberty. Many people are being guided to eat more protein-rich foods like meats or take protein shakes or buy vitamin B or C supplements because they feel weak, tired, and run down. The galactic gateway that recently opened is causing tremendous upheavals in your physical, emotional, and mental bodies. It is ushering in a huge wave of cosmic energy that will continue coming in throughout this year and well into the next. The influx of energy is causing dramatic changes in your DNA that will help you ascend from the third dimension to the fifth dimension. The fear you have of the future is based on the past. The fear you have of the past is based on a future that hasn't happened yet. If you can let go of judgment, then there's no need for fear. Have you ever noticed that many of the so-called negative emotions are actually quite positive? For example, anger is really a sign of passion or love, and resentment is often an indication that you care deeply about something. The key to transforming negative emotions into positive ones is to understand that feeling something strongly does not necessarily mean being negative about it. It just means you feel it strongly. And once you realize that, you can take action based on your feelings instead of trying to deny them and bury them deep. Anger can be very good for when it's channeled into something constructive, like taking action against injustice. Resentment can actually be a sign of caring too much. If you don't feel resentment towards someone who has hurt or betrayed you, then their actions might not have affected you as deeply as they otherwise would have if you have cared less about them. And fear can be a sign of wisdom and self-preservation. 
It's just not always easy to see that when we're in the middle of feeling afraid or anxious. The divine light will lift you up out of the world of illusions, into a new reality of unconditional love and understanding. People who cannot let go of the past or forgive themselves and others will not find the peace that they long for. Forgiveness is probably one of the greatest tools that we can give you at this time, because without